For the past few months, I've been working on this 3D printer made from old disk drives, a 3D printing pen, an Arduino, and stepper motor drivers. One of my favorite things about this printer is that I can control it all from my Raspberry Pi laptop using gerbil controller. In this video, I will guide you through the steps I took to create this 3D printer. I started off by disassembling the first optical drive. Two of the drives I'll be using are from broken Nintendo Wii consoles, as is the one I'm currently taking apart, and one of them is from an old Dell computer. Here I am marking and screwing holes in the base for the first optical drive. Now I'm going to attach the drive to the base using screws from an old GameCube. I just installed the X and Y axes, and then I connected the top to the base. Next, I'm going to cut a rectangle out of a Wii housing and connect it to the previous base using motherboard mounts. Once I had everything wired up, I connected it to power and did the first test. Shortly after the first test, my Arduino short-circuited and was completely fried. I must have hooked up the wires incorrectly when I bumped the wires loose. So I bought a cheap China knockoff Arduino that worked just as well as the real thing. Next I connected a pencil to the printer and created a sick shape. Next I took my 3D pen apart.
Then I desoldered the hot end from the circuit board and then soldered wires connecting them back together. Next I cut the filament guide tube into a smaller piece and attached the hot end to one side of the tube and the extruder to the other side. Then I attach the shortened down 3D pen to the CNC machine. After a few tweaks and a lot of trial and error, I finally finished my 3D printer. So far I've only printed basic objects, but I'm excited to see what else I can do with it. I hope all of you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please leave a like and comment down below. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Adios.